Hey guys, and welcome to my bathroom. Watch as I attempt to dye my hair again. Okay, so just like the first time I dyed my hair, I'm going to be using the Revlon Frost and Glow Kit. This is what comes with it. It's the little cream developer and the powder, and you kind of just mix them together like so. You mix it, and you mix it, and you mix it forever until you're really tired and your arm hurts. Ugh. Okay, so once you have a creamy consistency, then you're ready to go. I'm just gonna put up my hair into sections so that it's a lot easier to apply the dye. Then I'm going to take an even smaller section like so and begin applying the dye with the little applicator stick thing. And basically I'm just kind of painting it onto my hair and I try to put more on the bottom than on the top so that the bottom is lighter and I make sure that my hair is fully combed out. Then I put foil on top of it. Make sure it's secure and we're good to go. Giggity giggity. And then I do this on each section of my hair, taking about an inch to two inch section of hair because I don't want it to be too big nor do I want it to be too small and have it take forever. And like I said before, if you want the bottom to be lighter and then it gradually uh, gets darker as you go up, you're going to want to put more dye on the bottom. This is what it looks like when I'm done. I'm so fierce, right? Okay, so now I'm just gonna put uh, this cap on. Excuse my sneeze. And that's gonna seal in the heat. I'm gonna put it under for about 30 minutes and I'll get back to you. Okay, so 30 minutes have gone by and I'm going to check and see if the color that I want has appeared. So I'm just gonna open one, wipe off the dye, and no, I want it to be a lot lighter than that. So I'm just gonna put dye on it again, wrap it up, and wait a few more minutes. Okay, I've waited another 30 minutes, and that is much better. Now it's time to wash it out. So this is what it looks like curly guys, as you can see, no damage to the curl pattern. And this is what it looks like when I first straightened it. And this is what it looked like before, so it was a lot darker. And this is what it looks like now, super bright and blonde. Hope you guys liked the video, I'll see you later, bye!